Hello, this is Tim. We're going to be playing some of the Ultimate Doom, where we're going for 100% kills, secrets, and items on the Ultraviolence difficulty. We're going to be starting a new episode now, Inferno, the third episode. Um, from the original release, this was the final episode, but um, later there was another one, but um, let's just get it ready. So here we go, Inferno. Ultraviolence, as we said before. Now we start in this little weird area, where there's a... Uh, this is a switch. We're in hell, that's why everything looks a bit random. So we've got a couple of imps, one here, one there. So left, right, and straight ahead. So in this big area, we've got some boxes of bullets. Let's grab these. Oop. And we're going to, there's two switches here. We push the one on the left, and then move out the way. Now there's a few different ways of doing this. There's two cacodemons in there. We're just going to do some infighting here. Just, um, basically, you can imagine that the, um, Cacodemons are definitely going to smash them. Now in here we're going to have first new weapon, so let's... Now this... Just do not stop moving. Every time you walk out there it um, falls down. As we see the bridge is completely destroyed. You you have to keep moving, get the shotgun and keep going. You can't... There's an invisible wall here with these three uh, imps, so just come and take them out. Now, if you get if you fall in there, you can sort of walk around, um, and you'll pop back out here. So just be aware of that. So here, here's another invisible wall here. Anyway, let's just come back here. You, you guys need to take each other out. Okay, you're doing that. Let's see if I'm gonna. We'll just take you out. Just saving my. Um, for the moment. Now we've got, is that all the imp, imp corpses? Yes it is. So this way if I'm trying to line them up so I only really get attacked by one at a time. Right, one of the cacodemons is dead. Now one thing that's a bit different about this episode, we have to get through five levels before we get to the um, chainsaw, so keep that in mind. Let's again, let's just, um, actually we're going to open this door, bring the demon out if we can. Oh, here we go, let's just get some infighting going here. Just save a bit of ammo, not that it matters too much, it's fine to use your weapons of course but awesome. Come on. Nice. Okay, that's gonna be the imps gone. So we just need to position to Oh, no. Let's finally get some health here. Come on. Ah rather not get that yet. Come on, fire, fire. Come on. Why are you up there? Get down here. Come on. Yes. Oh, gotcha. Oh, nice. If I can get it. Here we go. Are they fighting? Yes, they are. Alright, they're gone. So there's a bit of a linear path through here, so if I don't fall in two, I'm just going to switch to a pistol to finish them off, instead of putting a third shell in. Go down. There we go. Because they will take, do random amounts of damage. So 18 shells is plenty. Now this door is going to trap us in here, I think. I don't think it opens again. Yep, we're locked here. We're almost finished though. Just imps in here, so there's no infighting. I just didn't want to run out, so I have to pistol all these guys. Now, before you run ahead and get excited, I think it's the only secret of the map. The um, uh, rocket launcher, and here we go. This is the end. 
so quicks that's everything Hellkeep is finished I love this picture here and now that is done so next one's going to be the Slough Despair so let's save up quickly E3 3M2 so thanks for watching and next time we'll be doing episode 3 mission 2 the map that looks like a hand but until then thanks for watching see you then All right, bye